with coronavirus. Everything went, came to a halt. Uh, we had to postpone it. We decided we will postpone it. We really wanted it to happen this year. So we said August. And then we found out in August that, okay, there is no more lockdown, but still there are plenty of restrictions on gathering, on physical presence. So we thought, you know, in a time like this, it's also important to send the message that uh, culture is important. It's, I think, quite welcome at a time like this when people have really been struggling. Um, you may have noticed the price of the ticket isn't really that expensive. Um, and we did that obviously very deliberately because we wanted, to be, uh, we wanted it to be accessible to as many people as possible. I really love our man and I, I really wish I could be there and um, it's happened like quite a few times since um, the pandemic that we I mean all filmmakers we haven't been to go been able to go to any film festivals and everything's on zoom so um, I guess now I'm, I'm used to it but this one's particularly painful because I really would have loved to have, have been there and um, yeah I've been there with my friends and family. It would be nice if somehow the, the, the country and the powers that be empowered this festival to be able to you know, show bold work. We're hoping that this will be a really good trampoline for us to be able to jump off next year and continue to develop um, uh, you know, all these talents that exist and that just need a bit of nurturing. A movie is still always special and not having been able to watch a movie for, for around six months, it's, it's exciting to do something new but also something familiar by going with, with someone and watching a movie on a big screen but also in a wholly new experience, at least in Jordan.